everyone, today, let us see how to build change data capture system, on Apache Hadoop, using, hTrunk. In a nutshell change data capture is nothing but, isolating the changes made to enterprise source systems, and is often abbreviated as CDC. The idea behind CDC sounds simple, but building an efficient CDC system is not as easy as it looks. There are four main ways to detect changes. 1. Audit columns. In most cases, the source system contains audit columns. If the DBA allows backend scripts to modify the data, there is a high risk that you will eventually miss changes during your incremental loads. 2. Database log scraping. Log scraping effectively takes a snapshot of a database redo log at a scheduled point in time, usually midnight, and parses it for transactions that affect the tables required. If the DBA empties the contents of the log, all transactions within them are lost. 3. Timed extracts. Time-based selection may create duplicate rows if the load is restarted from failures. 4. Full database difference compare. Full diff compare keeps a full snapshot of yesterday's database and compares it record by record against today's database to find what has changed. This technique guarantees change capture, but it is very resource intensive and costly operation. With Apache Hadoop and Apache Spark, data storage and processing is not a costly operation at all and hence hTrunk uses full database comparison technique to identify the changed data. Using hTrunk, we can do a CDC on any Hadoop ecosystem storage, like CSV, XML files, or Hive table, or HBase tables, or Parkit and more. Now, let us see using hTrunk's drag and drop pre-built components, how easily one can implement CDC on Apache Hadoop. Running a CDC on Hadoop requires data to be on Hadoop system. The data from the source systems are imported to Hive tables, or as files using hTrunk's import components. hTrunk provides seamless connectors to all major systems. For this demo, let us consider MySQL as our source system. To import the data from source, create an import job. Drag the source connector and configure. Drag the column mapping component. If required, configure the column mappings to import a subset of columns required. Drag the target component and configure HDFS as target for example, and trigger the job. That's it. You have imported from an external system onto HDFS. We now create another transformation job to perform the CDC on the imported data. Drag the component to read the history data, another component to read the latest import and configure. Drag and configure the CDC component. In CDC component, the user can select the columns on which the change has to be captured, and all the key columns used for comparison. The column can be as is used, or add CRC checksum component, generate and compare checksum.
The CDC component outputs three data sets with inserts, updates and deletes separately. These outputs can then be used in the downstream components for further processing in the same job, or pushed to an external system. That's it. Using HTRUNK, we implemented a CDC on Hadoop in minutes. Thank you.